West African Secondary School Certificate Examination 2022 June Mathematics Paper 1. So we are solving the WASI 2022 June Mathematics Paper 1. General Mathematics, Core Mathematics Paper 1. So we are finding the length of the minor arc BRQ. So length of arc is given by the angle at the center of the sector over 360 degrees times 2 pi r. So theta is the angle here, which is 150 over 360 times 2 times pi. Pi is given in the question as 22 over 7 times r. The r is the radius of the circle, which is 4.2 centimeters. Now, when you simplify this thing, you're supposed to get 11.00 centimeters. So the correct answer is A. In the diagram, angle POQ is equal to 150 degrees. So the same diagram, we are using it to find the area of the sector OPSQ. Sector OPSQ. So this is the major sector. So this time we need to find the difference of in angles here. So we are finding the area of the sector. So area of sector. Area of sector is given by theta over 360. So this time it's minor sector. So 360 minus theta. 360 minus theta over 360 times pi r squared. This time we are dealing with area. So we will get 360 minus 150 over 360 times pi is 22 over 7, which is given then times 4.2 all squared. So when we simplify this thing, so let's see how we get. This will give us 210 over 360 times 22 over 7 times 4.2 squared. So this thing should give us 16 should give us um, 32.34, so 32.34 32 centimeters squared. So the correct answer is D. A ladder, a ladder 6 meters long leans against a vertical wall at an angle 53 degrees to the horizontal. How high up the wall does the ladder reach? So this is the wall. This is the ladder. Then the ladder is 6.6 6 meters. This is how high the wall is. And this is the horizontal. The down one is the horizontal. And the angle it makes with it is 50 degrees, 53 degrees. So we have an angle. We don't know the opposite side. We know the hypotenuse. So we have sine, sine 53. So sine 53 will be equal to opposite, which is h over 6 meters. So 6 meters times sine 53 will give you the, how high up the wall it is. So 6 sine 53, that will give us 4.79181, 4.79181, so that will be equal to 4.792.
to three decimal places. A cylinder open at one end has a radius of three centimeters and a height eight centimeters. Calculate the total surface area. So cylinder open at one end, the total surface area will be equal to area of only one circle plus area of the curved surface area two pi r pi r h two pi r h two pi r h the curved surface area so and total surface area is given by that formula so the pi is 22 over 7 times the radius which is 3.5 all squared plus 2 times pi 22 over 7 times radius radius is 3.5 times the height the height is 8 so times 8 so that will give us um, 22 over 7 times 3.5 squared that will give us 38.5 for this then this will give us 22 times 8 22 times 8 because 2 times 3.5 will be 7 7 will cancel the 7 downwards 22 times 8 is 176 so plus 176 so that's 8.5 plus 176. 38.5 will give us 214.5 centimeters squared. 214.5 centimeters squared. In the diagram, angle W, Z, Y, and angle W, Y, X are right angles. Find the perimeter of W x y z so since this is a right angle w z y is a right is a right angle triangle this is the hypotenuse for that triangle the hypotenuse is this w y so w y squared w y squared will be equal to 4 squared plus 3 squared so wy, the length of wy will be equal to the square root of 4 square plus 3 square, which is square root of 25, which is 5. So this is 5. So we take triangle w, x, w, x, y, which is also a right angle triangle. And so... Wx Wx squared will be equal to 5 squared plus 12 squared and that will give us square root of 13 square root of 169 which is 13 so this is 13 so now we have to add everything around the quadrilateral wx so we add wx which is 13 plus yx which is 12 plus 3 plus 4 and that will give us 32 centimeters so perimeter is perimeter is mm, 13 plus 12 plus 3 plus 4 which is 32 centimeters the length of a rectangle is 10 centimeters if its perimeter is 28 centimeters find the area so the length is 10 the perimeter which is 2 times of width plus 2 times of length 
is equal to 28 so 28 is 2 times of weight plus 2 times of the length which is 10 so 28 minus 20 we got 2 w so 8 is equal to 2 w w will be equal to 4 and you divide both sides by 2 so we need to find the area of the of the of the rectangle which is area is equal to length times width which is um, 10 times 4 and that will give us 40 centimeters square In the diagram mrw and mnst mnst are straight lines the length of segment mn is equal to the length of segment segments nr angle mnr equal 110 degrees and angle wrs is equal to 86 degrees find the value of x so the value of x this x plus this angle here should be equal to this angle external angle theorem we can use that method or other, any other method so since this is 110 this and this must be equal so divide 70 by 2 because the sum of the whole angles in this triangle M and R should be 180. So the remaining two should be 70. So each of them will be 35. 35. Each of them will be 35. 35 degrees. So this angle here is 35. Shit. 30. 35 degrees so we have x plus 35 degrees to be equal to 86 so x will be equal to 86 minus 35 degrees so 86 minus 35 will give you 51 51 degrees so this one about a 1.4 meter tall stood 10 meters away from a tree of height 12 meters calculate correct to the nearest degree the angle of elevation of the top of the tree from the boy's eye so let the boy's eye be here so the angle of elevation from the top of the tree and we're told that the boy is 10 meters tall the boy is 1.4 meters and he stood 10 meters away 10 meters away then we're also given that the height of the tree is 12 meters so from here to here is 12 meters from here to here is 12 meters so we have to subtract 1.4 from 12 meters and that will give us um, 10.6 so this is 10.6 and this is 1.4 the whole thing should be 12 meters so we can now calculate this angle here because we know the opposite side 10.6 we know the adjacent side 10 10 meters so tan theta tan theta this can be anything, it can be x, it can be theta. So tan theta will be equal to opposite, which is 10.6 over 10. So tan theta will be equal to 1.06. So theta will be equal to tan inverse, tan inverse of 1.06. And when you check that with the calculator, you should get 46.66 to the nearest to the nearest whole number to the nearest degree we have 47 degrees so the correct answer is b given that sign 5x minus 28 degrees is equal to cos 3x minus 50 degrees 
where x is between 0 degrees and 90 inclusive find the value of x recall that sine alpha or sine a will be equal to sine will be equal to cos 90 minus a then also cos a cos a is also equal to sine 90 minus a the complementary identity so we're going to use any one of them i'm going to use that so i would want to change cos 3x minus 50 to sign so i'm going to use the second one so cos 3x cos 3x minus 50 will be equal to sign 90 minus so the a now is 3x minus 50 so sine 90 minus a 3x minus 50 so but this cos 3x minus 50 is equal to sine 5x minus 28 so i'm going to put sine sine 5x minus 28 here is equal to sine into bracket 90 minus 3x plus 50. so now the functions are the same so i can equate their argument i can equate their argument the expressions here can equate them so i'm going to get 5x minus 28 is equal to 90 plus 50 which is um 140 minus 3x so if that is the case grouping like terms we have 5x plus 3x will be equal to 140 plus 28 so 8x 8x will be equal to 168 so 168 divided by 8 will give us 21. S equal 21. Option C. In the diagram, M and R is a tangent to the circle center O at N and angle NOS is equal to 108 degrees. Use the information to answer questions 30 and 31. So find angle, find angle OSN, OSN, this angle here, this angle here. So that angle is equal to this angle. So if it is A, then this also be A. So A plus A plus 108 equal 180 so 2a equal 180 minus 108 that will give you that will give you 72 so a will be equal to 36 degrees 36 degrees so angle os and angle and os Okay, okay, angle OSN, OSN equal A, which is 36 degrees. So, we are continuing in the next video, which will be uploaded very soon. So, please, thank you for coming back to this channel. See you in the next video.